uh, can confirm it. It just runs in 30 FPS. Guys, I'm just too sad now, uh, given the fact that how quickly the hardware is aging. Yes, the hardware is aging real quick. I think in two or three years, PS5 will gonna be just down on its knees because we are just at the rampant growth of hardware, technology, new GPUs, you know, the horsepower having basically a 4090. I'm just stammering. I do not have any words because the kind of horsepower these days the GPUs are having, they are just absolutely magnificent. And secondly, guys, the thing is that uh, these GPUs uh, uh, probably could be the reason that we will going to be seeing the demise of PS5 uh, quite early comparatively than the earlier generation. Because if AMD comes up with something powerful in uh, NVIDIA 4090, uh, the things will going to be just developing very rapidly. And uh, with the RTX Neo 40 series, the budget GPUs, uh, whenever they're going to be coming in probably one year or so, uh, the budget gaming and the basically the future of gaming gonna be much more graphically intensive much more realistic i think uh, in the next decade uh, by the time we reach 2030 the gaming would have been just on the another level we will gonna be seeing a whole lot of new graphics and everything will gonna be just much much closer to real life the game sizes might reach to around 200 gps who knows uh, just gonna be just absolutely insane and i'm just very excited for this upcoming decade uh around 2030 things will gonna be just absolutely different than they are right now obviously there's gonna be 16k who knows 8k might become the new standard basically we know we all know how much 8k gaming is unpopular these days due to the fact that any gpu cannot just handle 8k 60 fps gaming at ultra settings but with the emergence of 4090 things will gonna be absolutely insane guys absolutely insane uh yeah let's quickly react to it guys so xbox series one x uh xbox series x basically and ps5 are just 30 fps as of now uh basically thanks to no dlss what the f <laughs> look at the frustration that dude is having just and here we are on the xbox series x in 20 wow it looks beautiful by the way 30 fps as standard and before people now telling me hey you have to download the day one patch this is what I have done or what the game has done. So the game is certainly officially out for the Xbox Series X and day one patch is out there as well. But